Mike, you've got this mysterious cardboard rectangle thing with you. What is that? <laughs> Let's talk, uh, let's talk snowfall. Let's bring in Matt Zika from the National Weather Service. He's the warning coordinating meteorologist. And we actually had this out this morning. Tell everybody what it is. I know what it is. <laughs> but. It's simply, it's just a simple snowboard and it's just a little board we put on the ground. And so as the snow falls, it accumulates. Put it right down yep, there. Just on the, the ground, just like that. It's light colored. So when the sun is out, it doesn't absorb all that warmth from the sun. And so when we do get a snowfall, it'll accumulate on that board. And officially, how often do you, uh, check it and wipe it clean. Every six hours we'll come out and measure what's on that board and then we get a daily amount by adding up the four six So we hour talked about this at dinner last night. If it snows two inches and it melts at six hours, it's a trace. Essentially, yes, that's what happens. And so unless we come out and take a special observation to catch the snow when it's there, but usually that's how it's going to end up. If there's no snow on the board when you make the measurement, then that's let's, what you have. Let's had. talk big snow because okay. this is an area where they average 200 inches of snow a year and they've got the snow sticks out here that go up to 60 inches. You can see 60 right there or five feet. Tell us a little bit about uh, how much snow you've seen pile up here. Well, in most years, typically our snow depth will be between 20 and 40 inches throughout the winter season. So usually from January all the way through March. Right. Um, in past years, our all time snowfall um, record, snow depth record is actually 80 inches. So that occurred. would be like up here. Yeah, like six Tall. feet, seven, eight inches. <laughs> and we have know? four sticks. <laughs> and we have extenders to put on. If our snow depth starts to get close to 50 right. inches, we'll come out and put some extenders on there. And you see the four sticks. So you come out yep. and, and do four measurements and take the average? Yes, that's what we do. It's wide open field here. So so we get some blowing. So we have four different sites we measure. We average them together, and then that gives us our total snow depth on the ground. There you go. Matt Zika from the Weather Service, Mike Bettis. 80 inches of snow on the ground. That's amazing. <laughs> right now, nothing. Tomorrow morning, we may have a white ground here. It is never a good thing, Mike, when you need a snow extender. Those should be outlawed. You should not be allowed to have those whatsoever. Hey, I appreciate it, Mike. Thank you so much. A nice little lesson there this morning about what exactly you do and how you measure snow.